Hey, uh, I'm out uh, at my mystery uh, antenna testing location. I'm actually I'm out here to do uh, QRP night, and I came out here the other day uh, with the G90 because we were having the uh, autumn sprints. And uh, I thought I'll use the G90 for this because um, my CW is not that flash. And I was hoping to use the decoder in the G90 to sort of help augment my um, my poor CW. And and that seemed like a good idea, but what happened is that um, the autumn sprint is on 80 meters, and I hadn't used the G90 out here before, certainly not on 80 meters, and so I just discovered I actually had a bit of a bit of a problem. Um, I'll try and show it to you. So, um, actually, this will be this will be a challenge. <laughs> How do I hold this stuff and talk at the same time? Anyway, look. Uh, let me turn it. Let me turn it on. Um, so, what are we using? I'm using um, 36 meter uh, random wire um, with a 9 to 1 unknown that I've used before, uh, and and you can see on the. So I'm getting this. I think, what is this? And and um, the other night, it was all through. It was all through the band, and what you can hear. Let me just turn this up. Doesn't matter where I tune, you get the same thing, right? It's, uh, News Talk ZB. <laughs> Oh gee, my favourite station. So um, I thought, oh gee, what am I going to do? So the, the, I uh, I brought out the 705 because I had used the 705 out here before, and I hadn't seen that problem. Certainly not on 80 meters. Um, and the 705 doesn't have that problem. So really, the front end filtering on the G90 in this case on 80 meters is is not enough. So what I uh, what I do have though is uh, a friend of mine, Neville uh, Z2. B &E, uh, he uh, he made a filter for me. So look, I'll uh, I'll plug that in, and we'll see uh, we'll see if that works. Just give me a sec. So now we haven't got news talk ZB. We've got uh, an actual station. So um, that, that's encouraging, and uh, and so that that works that works well. I oh here's, here's another one. So, um, so yeah, not a problem that I expected to have, um, but pleased that it was uh, able to be able to be fixed. Now, I've, uh, I haven't got this problem on um, 40 meters or 20 meters or actually any other band at all. It's only on 80 meters that I've, that I've had this problem. So, um, and I, in the activations, I don't use 80 meters, so it's never been an issue. So there you go, uh, un unexpected. Uh, <laughs> Unexpected issue, uh, but but solved with a with a um, with, with another filter. So um, so that's uh, yeah something different. I don't know if you've had a similar experience with the with the G ninety uh, and and um, other strong commercial stations. Um, I'd be interested to know. It's, it's not something I've ever seen here before, and it's certainly not something that I've had with the seven hundred five. So um, maybe one of the points of difference, but. Uh, the G90 generally uh, has been uh, been really great for everything else. Anyway, just thought I'd show you that. See ya.